dangling a bit of ham in front of it. And he was doing up trying to get it, and I just threw it over the fire. <laughs> the African orphans are so hungry. Did you cut that, Connor. What? The African. They are. That's just a fact. I think leave it in. All right, cut me getting paranoid. No, 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 leave. So far, everything stays. No. Yep. No. Yes. Connor, no, Connor. Connor. If Connor, you listen to me. You, you listen that. to me, Connor. You leave part of this. You leave part of this argument, and you make it funny. Yeah, you make you, it funny. You leave all of this. The reason Not why I'm it. fucking questioning it is because Brownie Towns. Oh, Michael's high. That's why I'm wearing safety goggles. Um. Also, uh, this is episode number thirty-nine, and we haven't told you guys yet because we've been really scared about it. We didn't want to tell anyone. Because it's a big secret and we'll be so scared telling people think that people will be angry at us. So we haven't said it yet, but uh, this is our second last episode for season number one. Yeah, so we'll come back. It'll be like, what, a month break? Yeah, right. So listen to this shit. You listen to this. So this is episode number 39. You're listening right now. So you got the final next week, okay? So what's that? What date is that? Early December? Four. It's four. Early December. So we won't up we won't record any new podcasts or they won't start coming out until the beginning of February. So two months, your ears eight weeks break. Your ears get eight week break. You don't fucking listen to any other podcasts. You don't you come back. You fucking come back next season because we'll have your sh- we got your shit. Huh? Who sent it? Huh? Who was it? <laughs> yes. Today's podcast. We're pretty sure we're going to unwrap some shit from you our PO box. Us some fucking shit. So this is a second last. So next week's the season finale and then we're off for eight weeks. And then the podcast comes back with some changes. Better than ever. And we're already, I'm already excited. I wish I could just get knocked out for two months. Hey, I wish someone could just knock me out for two months so that when I wake up, it's time for season two. I'll do the set. I'll redo it. I, I just want to be asleep. I want to be out unconscious. For two months, I don't want to hear a word, and then I want to wake up and start the second season. That's how crazy shits. It's it's it's. We got some great new segments. Yeah, what are they? We're, oh, <laughs> you fucking wait! I ain't saying shit, but there's 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 good ones. Yeah, they're gonna be great. No, no. Not just good, great. Uh, we'll We're gonna get you guys we'll... to send phone numbers in of your friends explaining situations of bad things they're going through, and then we'll call. Say if they're in trouble with the police, we'll pretend to be the police. And so gonna, they're going to get arrested. Yeah, we're going to... Yeah, so you guys construct our prank calls that we do. I think that'll make them a little better than... Because Domino's is starting to fucking catch on. They, they're over it. Yeah. They don't want to fucking hear that shit no more. So to make it sustainable, the prank calls, we're going to leave it to you guys. We're going to make it much more interactive in season two. And uh, the P.O. Box, hopefully we'll have a fucking shitload of stuff. A shitload because of we've shit. already we've already been sent some stuff from the P.O. Box. Thank you to the you bloody legend taking the time to do that. Someone's <laughs> shit in the bag. <laughs> as Someone's soon as we opened up the P.O. Box, it just fucking reeked of shit. It was so bad. But it's it's our fault. We did ask you to send some shit. We also asked sure you we said, we said to like, send anthrax. Can I just put a fun. hold on the anthrax? Don't, Don't do actually, that. Don't actually send anthrax, please. Um, Someone tried to. Yeah, so just just send us drugs or... Um, shit. No, I don't know about this shit, eh? It sort of fucked the whole P.O. Box area up. <laughs> yeah, we've definitely ruined that area. I hope it is shit because it's not horrible. It's in the shed. We haven't brought it out yet. We're going to... It's been in there for out. a few days. Festering. Oh, what will it be? Multiplying. Do you reckon it'll be like wet or hard? I think it'll be a little bean. A little being will dig out of the poo. <laughs> I like that. I like all that. right. Uh, all right. Next segment. We have uh, it's been renamed to Mad Reunion. Oh. And basically it's a segment where I just be typing on the keyboard. Oh. And that's the end of that s- segment. Now we move on to the second segment. Which is called my this is the bait get the bait get the bait down into the swamp. There was a whole segment on typing then. <laughs> yeah, that is new. Matt from wholesome. That's season two, baby. Matt from wholesome wanted to start experimenting uh, with brand new pop up segments. He's called them. He's called them pop up segments. <laughs> pop up. 
Boop, boop. Like that. Boop, boop. That is quality shit. Boop, boop. You can't top that. You can't top that in any way. Holy shit, that was good. For this segment, whoa, whoa. we just answer questions that you guys have sent in. Um, and the first question is from this person here coming in. Oh, it's Michael's roommate. Come on in. Here he comes. He's looking through the door. He's unsure of whether he can come in or not. We're calling him in. We're saying, come in. Here he comes. Right here, he's not sure which way to go. There's cords in front of him there. Let's see what decision. Oh, he's going for the leg over. Whoop, Ooh. ones. Yeah, there we go. He's made Sorry. it through. There we go. It's Lockie's, uh, it's Michael's uh, roommate coming home there. <laughs> so, yeah, just so, you, like, it's just, it's live and raw here at Marty and Michael, you know, anything could happen. <laughs> Isn't that right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah so, just about anything. <laughs> it doesn't get, it doesn't get much more random uh, than this show. So, it's yeah. crazy, man. You're crazy. All right, question time. All right, this one's from. These are the questions from you to us. We love them. Keep coming. Here we go. Arez underscore AC underscore. Do you speak German? That's a no from me. Yeah, and a no from me. Yes, he does. And if I've probably told this in a previous podcast, there's nothing more funny than watching Marty talk to his mother on the phone. Look, I'm just making noises. All right? he, I just make noises. And apparently it is another language, as some people know, as, as uh, German or, or German. German I it's believe. always at the end. Tschüss. You always say that. Tschüss. Tschüss. Oh. Like, Tschüss. That's your ending every time with your mom. No, you I say, being I just, German to your mom is a fucking, I just the pretend. funniest joke ever. I just pretend. I pretend to be on the phone. I don't actually speak German. <laughs> Dude, I want to do a whole... Have we, We've done uh, that in a prank call where you just speak German, haven't we? I don't think so. I want that to happen. Well, today we're not doing the mumbled man. Yeah, which is German. Being Mumbling is German. Next question is from Kashi0679. You are the most funniest pair on YouTube. Not really a question, but a uh, great question. Yeah. Yes, is the answer. All right, this is from drink underscore drank underscore drunk. 88. 88. Yes! This might be a long shot, but what's your guy's favorite alcoholic drink? I'm not sure why that's a long shot. Um, mine uh, has probably evolved to uh, red wine over the years. Uh, I used to hate it because of the uh, cask wine days when I was 18. I used to drink wine out of the cask there, so that sort of fucked my taste buds up for 10 years, but... Yeah, I enjoy the wine. A little wine, any 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 alcohol really, but you know, I put them all in front of me. I'll pick a wine. <laughs> <laughs> That's all I've heard all day. Is that laugh? <laughs> Marty says something, plays that laugh over and over. <laughs> I go a beer, any beer. Oh, I'm playing with my moustache right now. Oh, I can nearly do that thing where it's like two little spikes at the end. So yeah, I've been working on it hard. I don't even Next ca question. care about Movember. This is from Jay Dodds, 88. And you've got to fucking answer this because this is your fault. Yeah, Marty, why did you rip my gift, you German asshole? Also, what's your fave beverages? We just answered the beverages. But why did you rip up the CD that he got us? I can't even remember that. And yeah. I will deny it until the day I die. That's good. Yeah, it's a good answer. Sorry, I shouldn't ask. All right, this one's from... Car? Molly for Four Tigers. Tigers. What oh. music are you guys into? Um, I like uh, the sound of babies crying and then like soft piano playing dubbed over the top. Mixed with the baby crying, and I also like to listen to uh, car doors slamming shut. Type into YouTube animals committing suicide with Piano Man playing in the background, and it's f like that's probably my most favorite music. So, that one song, Piano Man, because someone's, someone's put it in a YouTube video where animals kill themselves. Well, they commit, yeah, yeah, they commit, yeah, exactly. Taurus underscore saying, Elizabeth what A. A what a, what if you could bring back one right, person no. from the dead, who would it be? Stephen Hawking's or Jesus Christ? Um, 
I'd probably bring bring back the hawk. Yeah, you got to bring back the hawk. Just he'd be good to have in videos. He'd be like that cool mascot, like, like pretty smart sidekick guy. Like, but like he thinks he knows a fair bit, but it's just like oh, it's just the sidekick talking shit again <laughs> that he read somewhere in a book that probably we wrote <laughs> or something. So like, yeah, I'd, it's a two out of those two choices, Stephen Hawking's for sure, and I'd shake his legs. I get his ankle, and then I fucking shake him, and he wouldn't, he wouldn't know what his legs are shaking for because I'd be hiding under a table or something. You'd be tempted to yeah, keep fucking with trying to make him move by her, like hitting or yeah. throwing, or tie, tying a bit of rope to the ceiling fan to his chair and then turning it on full ball. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, dude, I'd love to see that. Yeah, let's do that. Let's let's do that for a video. Dig his body up. No, we'll tie ourselves to a ceiling fan and we'll try and fly that way. Is that possible? Yes. I just did a small calculation in my mind. Yes. There you have it, folks. That's how I come up with video ideas. They just, they explode into my skull. And uh, I'll be bleeding from the nose for a while. So, enjoy. All right, this one's from Steve underscore B1993. Who would you rather kill out of Box Boy or Will Sparks? I'd probably kill, probably Box Boy. Yeah, because he's younger, so it would be more devastating to his family. No, just Will Sparks. If you're a big DJ and you decide to just not show up, fair enough. I'd probably do that too. But if you're Box Boy, you fucked everything up. Not only yourself, but everything. Everything's fucked because of you. <laughs> yeah, that's true. I was laughing at something else. <laughs> <laughs> All right, next question's from. Geordie underscore Wyatt. Wyatt. Question for the podcast. What do you think happens to our consciousness once we die? Fuck, that's deep. I think it um, turns into grass. And then that's why when you're fucking when I'm mowing the lawn, you get that weird smell. Because you're yeah. cutting. Everyone thinks, oh, it's cut grass. No, it's. it's uh, that's the souls. Consciousnesses. Yeah. Oh, that's pretty spot on. I think. I reckon... Don't quote me on that, but I think that's what that is. And look into the simulation theory, kids. Jonas.1. When is Michael going to cut off his shoe? Oh, hair? fuck me. How the fuck did we forget talking about this earlier on? Oh, oh, oh. We did a video. I did it. I've been getting messages for like two years. Hey, cut Michael's hair. Hey, cut Michael's hair. Finish up cutting Michael's fucking hair. I read them all, all of them. So I decided to trick Michael and I told him, I don't know if anyone's seen it, but there was a video Jenna Marbles did a while ago where she lies on the ground, strains all her hair out and then gets like hairspray and sprays it until it's like all stuck up and it looked very, very funny. So I said, hey, Michael, we're going to do this. We're going to do this with your hair. And then lie on the ground, hairspray, hairspray. And then when it was getting real stiff, Marty, get this right. <laughs> Marty pulls a knife on the cunt. He doesn't. And then just cut it all off. Cut his hair straight line. But like, look. He broke the rule. The number one rule that Michael said, don't fuck with my hair. I fucking, fucking did it. So now it's opened up the floodgates and I can attack Bosley for a vid yep. on our website. I, I, will, I will allow him to, uh, to stab Bosley. Just like a three centimeter. Thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nothing. No deep tissue. Just, oh, no. We'll see. Yeah. But yeah, that video is coming out soon. But he's fucking went to the hairdresser and uh, they made it all even and shit doesn't even look bad. So it's not long. Yeah, it's not long. But like he doesn't look like a freak, which is what I was hoping for. Hmm. Yeah, it went better than it could have. Anyway, next clearly. My fear come. Nick <laughs> dot Everingham. Do your mothers listen to your podcasts? No. Oh, no. no. I don't think mum uh, even... N- Knows about the podcast, does she? Can you ask her? Mine might, but she wouldn't listen to it. Yeah, they know better than that. I had like aunties, I think, listen to it and they were like, it's what the fuck. We're the truth bombs. We're the truth bombs of the family. <laughs> that could be a tag. That that could be a it's band a our band's name. Truth bombs. We're the truth bombs of the family. First single is disco dancing. The truth bombs is out. We're the truth bombs of the family. 
I like Sherbet Sisters. I've been uh, trawling the internet um, all week. Still haven't found anyone throwing any human shit at Judge Judy's back. But I'm hopeful that we get something before Christmas. So don't forget, whenever you see a video online, hashtag someone throw human shit at Judge Judy's back. So let's well, just uh, a moment of uh, applauding there. It's come a long way. That hashtag has come a long way. I saw it on a building. I saw it on a building. Tagged with graffiti or an actual sign? No, I saw both. What's the next segment? Oh, shit. Oh, do we get to do, oh, we get to do oh, P.O. Bo- oh, fuck. Hey, everyone. It's what you've all been waiting for. Someone sent in some human shit into our P.O. Box, I think. And we're going to jump onto the P.O. Box segment. Here's the new name. <gasps> <laughs> it's called panic to pleasure that's what that audio clip is called yes that saved a lot of shit dude panic to that- pleasure and this is a segment where we just open the shit that you guys sent to our p.o box we got letters here hopefully not full of anthrax there's no more climate change from that one, mate. That was perfect. And also, in the garage outside, we have a box, and I'm pretty sure there's some human shit in it. And, as you all remember, Michael said, if someone sends in human shit, he'll wipe it on his face. I think Now I'm saying I'll think about it, but that's such a pussy. Michael is now oh. opening the first letter. Michael is now opening the first letter. Is there anything, drugs in there? I mean, things in there? Oh, hang on. There's a letter here. Oh, what do we got here? So the first thing is a picture of cows, if you can see Give on YouTube. Give me a YouTube. fucking look at that. Oh, oh yeah. Which that one, one would the, you do out of all of them? The one on the right here. That one actually looks familiar. That's the one I would uh, fuck for those watching on YouTube. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I've already had that one. You can tell by the bend in its neck. <laughs> you bend to the left. Yeah. What? All right. Uh, Did you rip it already? No, no, it was like this. See, it's just a bit of paper here. Okay, so in the envelope was a picture of cows and uh, here we have uh, two little fucking letters that were also in that. And it says, Cows are love. Cows are life. Keep up the quality vids that make me laugh and keep my cow fetish under control. At Dylan underscore eight underscore from Sydney, Australia. Thank you, Dylan. That was beautiful. (laughs) There's more! This was also in the same envelope. The one dollar that it cost me to purchase the stamp for this letter comes from a cow's cunt. I prefer to fist the beasts because it adds a personal touch you just don't get with a dicking. Hope you appreciate. <laughs> Takes a lot of strength to uh, come forward and be that that graphic and that detailed uh, for you know an eight-year-old. This picture has a new place. So I thank you very much uh, for that. Much appreciated. Uh, <laughs> spit down my chest Alright, this one might have anthrax in it Because it has been pouring out shit all day Okay, I'm just gonna cover Go ahead and cover my face it's now It's glitter though Oh fuck, you've inspired me to We should not have asked uh, people to send in anthrax I regret that I'm gonna stop talking about anthrax My shirt stayed up I'll just Oh yeah, it, it shows my nostrils and it won't go down nostrils, it won't boost it up. That's just glitter. Is it just glitter? I reckon. Lots of glitter? Yeah. Lots Does of glitter. people want us to get mess or something? Is that what that is? <laughs> get mess. So someone sent us an envelope full of glitter. So thank you. And also this with this note in it. Okay. Dear Marty and Michael, who's a pretty girl? Pretty, pretty, sprinkle, sprinkle. Oh, Very good start. I'm enjoying this. I actually can't wait for you guys to do a meet and greet. I would love for you guys to shout me out on Instagram at fio.sumerr. You guys are the best Australians. Don't stop making your videos because they're amazing. No one has ever made me laugh that much from Summer. Summer. Thank you. Thank you for saying what the rest of Australia is thinking. That's fair. That's a fair statement. Thank you, Summer. We really appreciate that. And the glitter is very pretty. Very pretty. Put that in the bin. 
Is there a bin near you? Throw that straight away. Just leave away. it there. No, no, throw it straight okay. away. We are not hanging on to that. All, All right. right, we have opening this the... This is from our friend Bryce. Opening the third envelope now from someone we have met before. Bryce, his name is. Let's see what he has sent us. Oh, a big letter. We have a beautiful letter. And, and a photo of when he met us. Here, that's me there on the right. That's Brycey boy wearing our merch shirt. And that here is Michael. <laughs> Those of you who are listening on Spotify, fucking go to YouTube. If you want to see the picture, just go to fucking Not YouTube. Hard. It's not hard. We've got fuck all subscribers. If you're on your phone, it's an it's an app. It's just watch it on YouTube. It's demonetized every vid we do. We do this for free. So there you go. Beautiful picture. And Michael, would you like to... I'll read the letter. Okay. Hey guys, it's Bryce. Aussie underscore carts 99. Here, how are yous going? I'm doing good. Just looking for work still. I'm no longer working. Are you guys hiring to be in your videos? Ha 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 jokes. Now, I'm always free to do anything. If you need more people to be in your videos or nothing, messages me on Facebook or Instagram and we'll go from there. I will always remember the first day we met. I still have that wristband, haha, and every day I watch your videos. And soon, hopefully, we will have a drink up and chill out. I want to hang out with yours more often. I print out your photo and I want you guys to have it. But anyways, keep us all laughing and good work. I will see you soon. P.S. And always remember, we are the best. Hashtag, we are the best. Love yous both. And my number is 04. Kidding, not going to read that. <laughs> Cheers, Bryce. You're a fucking legend, brother. Cheers, Yes, dude. we will do a uh, meet and greet soon. And we'll get fucked up and we'll smoke a bit of meth, eh? <laughs> So everyone, thanks for taking the time to write a cute little letters. Send in anything you want. It doesn't have to be a letter. It can just be like a, a random stick. Or maybe you'd like to send us a lock of your mother's hair if she's like undergoing uh, chemotherapy and her hair's falling out anyway. Just grab a little oh, tuft of it, oh. throw it in an envelope, send it down Marty and Michael. We'll have a fucking look at it. And then you can say to your chemo mother, hey, look, Ooh. look, mum, look, your hair made it onto uh, YouTube. And wouldn't yeah, that be it's an, better than nothing? An uplifting experience for a mother with chemotherapy. <laughs> All right, thanks. For, the PO box is right here for those of you on fucking Spotify. Oh, yeah, what about the shit? Oh my god, what everyone's been waiting for? Shit. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want to get it, Michael? It's your closest. Yeah. I'll be right back. Uh, uh, I'm sleepy deepy. It? Okay, I've uh, bought in the package. Bought in the package. Um, it's We had it in the garage because it smelt a bit f- f- shit. So we think this is shit, okay? So I'll tell you what it's from. <laughs> I'm scared to inhale. All right, so it's a... It's uh, no, a, I can open it, actually. It's all good. I it's a red it. bag. Oof. Oh, shit, be careful. Don't be careful. Then you open it this direction. There's going to be shit flying around everywhere. All right, Michael's pierced the bag. What's in it? Have a whiff. No, no, no just fucking open it. No, I'm not, I'm not smelling it. I like that. That's Whoa. sort of nice. <laughs> oh my God, that is fucked. I don't want to put my hand in there. Michael, you have to. Oh you ask the people for this. I'll just pour it out. No, you're not on the... Don't, don't, just in case it spills. Dude, don't, don't, dude. Dude. Okay, so fuck, get that... Dude. Fuck! Look how cute the container is. Oh, okay, all right. So inside that fucking package is a white container. The smell is intensified. I don't know if it's a shit smell. It's something rotting for sure. This could be anthrax. No, Shh. she doesn't smell like that. All right, we ready? Yeah. Open it. If you throw that on me, I will not, dude. Uh, you, it's not like you cut my hair or anything. Oh no. What if there's a bug in there? Oh. Oh my god, guys. It smells so bad. Oh my god. It is. It's porridge. It's literally grassy porridge. It smells so fucked. No, it's shit, isn't it? Yeah. That's what I think shit is grassy porridge. It looks like that. It's moving. I can feel it vibrating in the container. Right, move it away from the mics and stuff now. That is fucked. Oh, it's getting worse. Oh. Get rid of that. Get it outside. 
Oh, I sort of like it. No. Oh, yuck. <laughs> okay, we're all breathing through our mouth at the moment. <sighs> that is fucked. Someone has just sent us a little container of real oh. human shit. It's so hard not to gag right now. <sighs> that is fucked that someone did that. It's like, it's sort of cool, but it's, yeah, that's, that was properly sealed and everything, wasn't it? For those of you uh, who are listening, have a look if you can. Someone has sent us human shit. Uh, and, you know, and that's what we asked for. Right, now, we've some, now we've been sent human shit. So thank you. You don't need to do that anymore. So we'll just give a small, <laughs> small round of applause there to that person. Because that is, that's ballsy. It takes balls Dude, to shit in a container. The house, hey, it's fully fucked. Oh, not too much hairspray. I don't mind. I honestly did not mind that. Like, I, I, I realized I can't put it on my face. That's too fucked. Right, so Michael lied to everyone. Sorry, guys. Michael's lied to you. We couldn't put it on his but face. But I enjoy the smell. It's different. And it will only last a bit. We'll open the doors up. Someone sent us human shit. Thank you for listening to us. No more human shit. Only uh, other cool things. Fuck it. Some breast milk. Someone sent us some breast milk. Oh, yeah. All right, so uh, there you go. The P.O. Box uh, segment is really taking off and sort of becoming a, a beast on its own there. So thank you uh, for everyone sending you your shit in. <laughs> Literally, it's great. It really brings a lot of life and a lot of energy, a little power to the show. Oh, man, yeah, that is a powerful shit smell. It's pretty. That's a first. That's a fir- uh, surely no one's opened up human shit in a podcast before. Who sent? Who takes the time to send shit that's the main I'd, I'd, I'd like question. to meet them i'd like to meet that i'd person. have a beer or five with her yeah because that, that's pretty you can imagine how funny it would be shitting in the container it's and definitely a chick who did I it had it sealed like properly didn't they like mm. fully properly sealed yeah it was in one of those little tubs from very Vital. impressive very impressive all right our final segment has of course been <sighs> renamed to margaret <laughs> Uh, Margaret <laughs> And uh, this segment is basically where we just do a prank call We, I, I'm going to be the character, the mumble man So it's going to be very hard to hear me And that's for the joke <laughs> Also, um, yeah, like we mentioned This is the second last episode So we got next week and then the prank calls will be back better than ever in season two, okay? And every week there'll be it'll be a big part of it. God, there is so much shit in my mouth. I know. I hate what I did now. It doesn't go away. <sighs> I really wish it just would. It still lingers. Oh man, very very intense smell. Yeah, yeah, you go. <sighs> Ruin the house. I'll do this prank call with shit in my mouth. Yeah, get out, man. Just make a pickup order, please. A pickup order? What can I get for you? Yeah, man, a couple of pizza today. I'm gonna get um, one of barbecue meat lovers on uh, yep. classic day. Yep. I'm gonna get the um, Hawaiian there on the pan, on the pan, bit of the thick the one. Pan? And then what was what size you got going on at the moment? Is there any sub deals you got going on? Mm, any type of deals going on? Two, two large pizzas going on? Deals going on? Um, we've got two large pizzas, a garlic bread, and a drink for all that's just a check. What about? For 2780. What about one of the desserts then? We've got a couple of lava cake. Um, so do you, do you want to get a lava cake instead? Yeah, just in the, the same value plus comes, comes together at the same price. And, Um, did you want me to put it like just on the side so it should be gonna chop lava cake? Yeah, no, no, sure, yeah, put it on the side then a little bit. Yeah, okay. just a little bit then, yeah. Yeah, so that one that just comes to thirty one twenty five. What about the what about the um drinks there? Is it gonna cut as far as tonight? Um, some drinks, we've got the like soft drinks? Mm, yeah, so what have they got on soft drinks or well, anything really? <laughs> Seven up or Mountain Dew. 
No, oh, the sun kiss is the only one bubbles on it. Is that uh, 1.5 or uh, 600? Um, we've got 1.25 or we've got the can. Yeah, I'm looking at can of the sun kiss there and I'm putting it down 1.25 in your G. Yep. That's really, really all back to me. Yep. Read the little back to me. Yep, so we've got the classic barbecue meat lovers, the deep Hawaiian, the chocolate lava cake, and the can of sunkiss. Mm, and then there's so, the other side of the part of the valley, the you know, garlic bread, and part of the garlic part of the valley. Uh, garlic bread and a drink? Yeah, is that part? Is that part of the? What, what are the deals? What are the deals you got going? It's part of the you know, deals. I know the lava cake on the side, but just garlic bread and the original deal. Um, so the price has gone down to twenty seven thirty with two pieces of chocolate cake and sunkiss. Oh, that's great. Look the one last little thing with the wine I'm getting him on the hiding in when you bring it over. Sorry? Well the one last thing with Hawaiian makes me put yep. him on the hiding when when you bring it over tonight. Um, yep. Um, sorry, I just can't understand you properly. Yeah, no, no, that's all, that's all. So it wasn't Hawaiian. Is it extra, extra ham, even if you have pulled a salt? Um, I'm sorry, sorry, I still can't get that. Um, are you doing pickup? Could you talk to me when you came into the store? You look, look, you put down, you put down a couple of them, I'll come in about 15 minutes or so, I'll look down again. Is, is that what you called it? The Hawaiian? Mmm. Yeah, so it's just the deep Hawaiian with um, ham cheese and pineapple. What about the cup of water? Sorry? What about the cup of water? Read out your order. No, 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 no. It's just a cup of water. Um, sorry. Just give me two seconds, sorry. Thanks for holding. <laughs> a Domino's team member will be with you shortly. Keep getting more and more. I'm not going to make any sense for the rest of the call. <laughs> yeah. Hi, sorry. Are you there, sir? Mm hmm. Okay, so we've got the order. So it comes to 27.30. It's the classic barbecue meat lovers. The mm -hmm. Hawaiian chocolate lava cake and the sun kiss. Yep, as well as except for the ham and cheese and the pine on the farm. A ham and cheese instead of a Hawaiian? No, 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 no. At least not, right? So now you're going to ham and cheese, bring your ham and the swan tonight. Hmm? Okay, just give me... Really? Yep, just give me two seconds. No. It's not... 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 Sorry? You read back the order. Yeah, you've made your order for meat lovers, a Hawaiian, a lava cake, and a can of sunkiss? Mm, yes, yeah, so this is what the lava is. This is a ham and cheese. Put it on the floor tonight, right? And you can glass of water with it. You can go on, you can bring it in. Mm, and the cable, you can bring it in the bank. If you can bring it up, it's like just like it's a trap. Sorry, sorry, I'm 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 sor